So if you shoot on Sony, Canon, R5C, or the likes that shoot on uh, XML, X, MXF file, then you might be having trouble to preview your files. Sometimes you shoot files like CROM, that's camera roll, or you shoot on MXF. Now, I want to show you what you need to do. You can actually edit them on CapCut, actually. Yes, you can you need to convert them and lose your quality and compress and all that and all that. So, I can easily preview them, actually, because I have VLC player. If you have a VLC player, you can actually preview them. But if you don't have this, you mostly can't preview them. So, if I double-click on it, because it has the VLC icon, you can see it, it can play. So you can see the video actually playing. You can see the file here is MXF file format. So I'm just going to cancel that. I've already copied this to the desktop for this tutorial purpose. So I'm just going to quickly take my drive and let's get straight into it. So I'm going to open CapCut. So this is CapCut. And right here, I'm just going to show you how this works very smoothly without any stress, without going through anything, like going through the hustle and that. So I'm just going to drag it and it's just going to work simple, very easy. So it will give you this information that says one or more clips contain multi-audio tracks and yeah, you can see no more reminder for this project. I'll just say okay because I want it to remind me again once in a while. I know that. So this is it. The file is already here. But you might experience something like, I'm just going to reduce the volume because there's music from uh, the performance, I don't want to get copyright strike. So, what I'm going to say is this this particular file might be lagging depending on your computer or because it's a ProRex file. So, you say creating ProRex file. So, you're going to give it some time to completely create a ProRex file before you go ahead to start editing so that you don't experience that issue. So, I'm just going to click on play again to see if it's working now. So, it's no more giving me that complain and all that but you can also for that more you can change your frame rate to 25 frames per seconds and all that you can do all those settings like we change them so you're just going to go into modify and frame rate you change it to 25 or 24 frames depending on what frame rate you want to edit on then you can change your resolution to custom and original and all that and all that so, I hope this helped you. If it did, go ahead, let me know in the comment section, smash the like button, subscribe. Yes. And that tutorial will be coming right very soon. Bye for now.